Half past three a.m. Six hours to go until I have to wake up. A very full Monday. Today is Sunday. I have no idea if you see this video, this part in this video, if there will be a vlog or anything. Because I have no time tomorrow. Hi. This is what I thought yesterday night. Um, where the Monday was like dangerously full of activities to do and I had no idea how to prioritize them and what to do how when why and where and I tend to undervalue you know my own work in terms of time management and then please others or do other things first uh, just because I feel like ah uh, I can I can shift my work around doesn't mean I have to or I should you know in Germany there's like the saying cutting into your own flesh it also works in English. Maybe it's a saying there as well. You know, taking away from yourself by trying to meet other things. And so tomorrow morning I re-evaluate everything because I didn't, wouldn't even have enough time to record a vlog on the side. It was too stressful. Also, if the weekends are full for me, the week also feels more stressful. So blah, blah, blah. here we are. <laughs> and if you see this video on a Monday, I made it. Um, why was everything so full today? Why a little intro today? I had, I was booked for a job, a uh, TV sound design, you know, sound uh, technician job. Then I had singing lessons, then I want to shoot the video, the short video, edit it, go to the gym with my gym partner, also like, you know, I have to see the timing, then tomorrow morning, again, something else, then stream, then Wednesday podcast, then uh, th uh, Thursday gym and uh, stream and Friday and, and blah, 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 blah. so and when the weekend is full we have no never time to rest but uh, luckily yesterday some plans were cancelled so I had some time for myself um, so don't worry but I now decided to you know this year and also I decided to do it next year as well uh, to take this serious right so I have to treat it as a serious job. So priority number one today would be to get the videos out to you. And so I cancelled some other plans um, who were yeah, just then less important after re-evaluating and now we are here and it's also needed because uh, my apartment is in, it doesn't maybe look like it but it feels chaotic and I mean it's just enough if I take this one pizza <laughs> so today is uh, this episode is more like it's a cleanup but it's you know to have a title for it it's more like the big trash episode because I didn't have trash bags for the last week. I forgot to buy them, I think two times when I went to the store and I didn't feel like going there again. So I stuffed everything into one bag and then tried to fit more and more in. So it's kind of like, you will see. <laughs> and now I have to fix that situation up, right? Get the old garbage out, uh, put all the garbage bags back in and collect all the garbage that has been finding its way into different rooms where it doesn't belong. And how do we do this? It's a whole different angle. It's not the kitchen, it's not here, it's in between. How do we do this? With the in-between camera, hi. Not a full view into the kitchen. There's dishes there anyway, we could have uh, as well done a dishes episode. But everything else I can easily do um, after I fix my trash situation. And you will see, um, you know, I try to show it to you, but this is even hard to get it out. This is me trying to stack everything on top of each other. Also disregarding uh, everything, just having one bag here. So I later have to separate it again when I go to the trash downstairs. But I somehow now have to try to get this out of here without losing everything. Or you know, throwing it on the ground and then having to clean more. Ah, oh, but it looked amazing. It works amazing. Lovely. I know trash is probably not the most attractive thing 
to show on camera, but hey, this is life. And uh, this is how it goes. Also, if you're wondering why I look a little bit weird on this camera, it's a typical 0.5, you know, they use for these type of videos on uh, TikTok. I don't even know if it looked like that, but maybe you, you know. Uh, 0 0.5 means it's a little bit wider and fish eye up and the and the like the edges of the video of the screen feel like a little bit warped everything looks a little bit weirder you know because it's not your eyes it's a camera lens and i bought new trash bags so i just have to put them back in ow but first i have to get a second one to collect all the you know trash that is lying around i also heard that you should not put pizza things into the paper trash because it has so much fat on it so i will not do this and if any germans are here just tell me you know tell me if that is a thing because even for germans it's sometimes a, a, a myth how to and when to separate the trash. If you don't know, if you don't know this at all, by the way, even more um, trash. <laughs> if you don't know this, in Germany we separate trash with like biological trash, um, plastic, and then something else and something else, something else. It's a whole thing. It's a whole thing. And I mean, of course, what would be a stressful day without Breakfast in bed. <laughs> Cause too lazy to get up. Um, yeah. Yeah. The rest of the trash is in the kitchen, which is now not visible for you, but you know, some just know that all have collected. Also, I have, um, I've been, I have, I had, I am. <laughs> Over the weekend, um, next birthday party and all. I say you, every, every, I tell you the same every Monday. And if you would ask me, I would be like, I'm not a guy who goes out a lot, but apparently I do, but it's mostly birthdays. So what can I do if my friends have birthdays in August, September, October, then Halloween is coming up, right? It's a big party. It's a big deal. Um, cause, uh, friend of mine a good friend of mine will ah I forgot to mm, ah. um, I forgot to separate this one um, and it's a big thing because this will be the last one and blah 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 like it just it, it, my mind is occupied with it and also with me you know taking oh there's Super Mario advertisement on the pizza bag that's how you get me put Super Mario on your pizza I'm, I'm down. Also, this was my typical Sunday. I'm lazy pizza. I'm not advocating for you to eat pizza all day long. Even though I say I, I just basically only ate the pizza and the rest of it was just protein and some uh, vitamins and stuff. So you can check your calorie intake and eat a pizza in between. Because life is life. Na 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 na. <laughs> <laughs> this song, uh, but life is life and you just should have, should have some fun as well, right? We all only live once and uh, So I ordered that had a very chill Sunday, but on Saturday I was out again until 3 a.m. karaokeing my voice away um, What can I say T tomorrow morning I got a little little bag in Germany we say it Hexenschuss but it was, it was only a little thing, like when your back's like, you make a certain move and all of a sudden you, you lock up. My, my back locked up and I was like, ah, luckily I'm still young, flexible and sporty enough to like, you know, be able to walk it out. Um, I will put some heat on it later and then it will be all fixed because gym is today, so it has to function. But also, I think I put everything in here all of the paper trash and then I have this is why I can carry it better easy um, back to the point um, I forgot my point which is fair um, 
I, yeah, weekends are just full now and I feel like I have a lot to do and obviously my apartment comes, uh, you know, it's kind of, it's kind of hurting because I do not have time on, on Sundays to like do, do like a full deep clean, which would be needed at this point. Like have like a full day of kitchen, bathroom, rest of the flat, you know, little, little mopping, little um, uh, dishwashing, no, a little vacuuming. But I don't have the time. I do not have the time. And when I have some time off, I do not want to uh, spend that time cleaning, right? For me, it's always like you have a, you have a Saturday off, you know, maybe to yourself um, or a Sunday, like one of these weekends you have to yourself, you have like maybe you met some friends, you have some, you know, whatever you feel is comfort, comforty for you. And then on a Sunday you feel like, and now I want to do something. So I clean for the good feeling of, um, you know, it being then cleaned or, uh, you know, I feel like I always relax better when the apartment is freshly cleaned then. Well, it's a little bit of a mess because it's always in the back of my mind that I still have to do something. We will also have to collect all of the dishes because they've been flying around as well. Because when I'm super busy, I just, I just put the things down where I use them. <laughs> Especially, no, that's not true. I only do this when the kitchen counter is already full. And it is. So trash, 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 trash. This is new. So now I can separate it again and have like no trash laying around in the apartment. And now, yeah, we might as well collect all the dishes. <sighs> now it's kind of become a habit that uh, imagine I thought like when a friend is coming over, right? For example, we are getting ready for a, a night out or a, a birthday party or whatever. And they come over on a weekend or on Fridays, right? And then, then they look into May. Oh, I found more trash. I found more trash. Up. Um, and then they come over and they're like, I can now say when it's, uh, it's like not clean, I'm like, oh yeah, don't mind this. This is just my content for Monday. <laughs> Oh, this would be insane to call like in an apartment that is not cleaned content. Holy, holy, holy. So this is my biggest issue because you, you all know by now my, my addiction with cereal and oats. And uh, I'm always a little too, oh, there's, hello, little leak. There's always, as you can see, too much stuff laying around. Cause it's such a bummer for me to, like, <laughs> I always think in energy, right? What do I get for the energy I put in? And to throw these away, I usually, like I can already feel here, have a little bit left. In this case, it's a lot. So I have to take this, put this into the, like, the one I'm currently using, like, you know, so I don't waste it. Then I have to separate this one from this one. It's like a three stage thing. I'm like, ah, I'd rather do this all together than one by one. Yeah. Always hurts me in the end. Uh, but sometimes, you know, I'm, I'm very uh, appreciative of, the, of this because when I, when I feel like I have nothing left, maybe I'm pretty close to the camera, I can't tell. Um, if then I have nothing left, uh, Food-wise, cereal-wise, I for sure have something left, some leftovers that I can put together. So that's the only part where it saves me. And apart from that, it's utterly useless. And just, you see how long this takes? <sighs> Why do all the good things are so short and the bad things take so long? <sighs> first word, first word problems. And then, you know, yeah. For, for fourth problem and then you have a little bit of oats left on the bottom that somehow found their way there and now you have it on the ground and you have to use a vacuum <laughs> by the way if you if you are not if it's hard to tell 
it's not a real problem. I'm joking. But you know, that's the reason why I'm too lazy to do this on the spot. Even though it would be better, I would highly encourage that. Because uh, since I, one thing I learned I'm very happy about to do immediately is, and while I'm doing this, is this normal? Having so much, nah, I don't care. I don't care, can't be creative if you're normal. So I take the be not being normal every day over being normal. Nothing bad about it, but you know, this whole normal, not normal thing, yeah. who can say that anyway? Who can judge that anyway? Um, one thing I learned um, over the past years is when you cook something, right? And you, you don't clean the pan afterwards right away. It A, makes it much more annoying. B, just fills up the sink. C, is somehow uh, even more disgusting to clean after like an hour or something. And, you know, if, if there is no mistake happening, right, for example, something is like stuck to the ground or burned, you know, so it needs a little soaking, then it's a different story, but it doesn't happen every day. And I just clean it because the motivation is so high because you're hungry. I just clean it before I eat. And I know when I eat, all the cooking utensils are clean. Easy, easy. And now comes the part of putting this into the existing ones. Which is, uh, now the, in hindsight, I think my mom hated this, right? Because I mean, when we were young, she had to do this. I mean, she taught me that, right? She had to do this for us, I guess. Because we were always leaving some, some rest in whatever. I don't know why we did that. I mean, I kind of know why. Because in the bottom of this, you have like all the small pieces and like the, the, the powder. And the powder is very... Uh, it's just not as tasty and like annoying to eat, doesn't have like the feeling. And now and if I am addicted to something, I obviously want to have it every day in the perfect condition. Even having a different uh, oat milk makes it kind of annoying to eat. And if you eat something for 20 years, you probably know by now how you want to have it in the morning. Such a big boost you don't understand I mean, maybe you do understand it's such a big boost of happiness for me it's insane there's so much in here i didn't know that with this one it's a different story because you know this is, this is basically oats with uh, some i mean some chocolate in it you know can go about your day's life with a little chocolate in it it's not not a saying you should live by but apparently how i live and here it's like super weird when you have when you open a fresh box and they are somehow they when they when they pack these they fill in um, the oats first or last depending and the, the chocolates before so you have like they are very separated so this is always a how to say a, a wonder no it's like random there's a little random factor in here how your oats will taste. I would like to have like a 70-30 split, right? 70% oats, 30% chocolate. So I have like, so I can sell it to myself as medium healthy. So I have some oats. Because if I eat oats alone, I, I just get sad because this just doesn't taste at all. And uh, this also gives a little bit of crunch to it because there is some crunchy stuff in here as well. And when you have the 70-30 split, it's just, just the right amount of sweetness, not too sweet, all good. But sometimes you have like the 90-10, 90% oats. Then we are in the oat category where I'm like, it's so dry. <laughs> or you have the 50-50 split, then it's too sweet. And you're just like, I didn't want to eat like, a, 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 like a, a dessert. I wanted to eat, you know, some cereal. So there's some randomness and it keeps you 
keeps you up. I feel like today you see the silly side of me, right? I'm talking about all these things. I normally would be like, oh, this is maybe too boring. I'm just rambling about it, right? But I think this is what makes us real, right? You being here while I really do it. And I just talk to thoughts that are on my head anyway. Um, and now the only thing left would be the dishes to do so that it feels better. Is this camera still with me? Hey, it is. Morning. And, um, you know, get the dishes done, take this out. But I, like I always say, it's no content. If I take this out, because then I'm just gone. So I will not take the trash out. Get the dishes ready. And then I will edit this. And then we see each other at uh, hopefully six. Would be nice, right? Six my time. Your time might be different. Or in another date of the week, or year, or month, or whatever you feel like when you watch this, or whatever YouTube feels like to show you this. Um, I hope you have an amazing day, amazing start to your week. And I don't know, maybe it helps you. You've been my priority number one today. <laughs> and from here on, on probably always. Um, there's, there's also a priority 0 0.5, but we're not talking about that. <laughs> and yeah, so as always, we see each other next time.